An emotional night here in Santa Barbara as the community gathers together to mourn the dead and missing. You can see a candlelight tribute now sits in honor of the lives lost in this horrific tragedy. United in their grief and sorrow, hundreds turned out for a candlelight vigil in Santa Barbara to mourn a tragedy that has claimed so much. Just feel like it's been disorienting and just felt overwhelmed the last couple days and an event like this really brought everybody together. It's amazing. It's uh, it's a little cathartic here tonight. I mean, uh, everybody is just reeling from this. Everybody's less than one degree of separation from the tragedy. The death toll now stands at 20. 30-year-old Peanut Suti Tepa, the latest victim found buried in the mud and debris. His two-year-old daughter Lydia among the four still missing. It's been devastating for all of us. Um, Santa Barbara is such a small town, so we know each other somehow. We have a friend or we heard from somebody who has been affected even for the loss of the loved ones. Crews continue to work around the clock in a desperate search to find the final victims and to clear the overwhelming amount of dirt and debris. Still no word on when the 101 may reopen. For some who turned out tonight, it was a chance to grieve and count their blessings. We've been very strong for a very long time as we were swept away in the creek on Tuesday, but we got out and uh, we were safe in our home and we stayed there for a few days until we were rescued. The emotion still so raw, the loss so extensive. Through tears and candlelight, they had the support of each other, a community showing its strength in the face of overwhelming tragedy. It's always amazing how uh, loss like this can really bring everybody together in, in a real positive way. And I think there was a real sense of hope and, and um, looking to the future that, that came out of the whole thing. And that hope, though, comes with concern tonight as there's the possibility of rain later in the week. Crews rushing to clear the debris basins and creeks in case more mud comes down.